Uh, hey guys, welcome back to the podcast. This is episode 181. Wow. Yeah. As, uh, Are you sure about that? I am. Okay, good. I checked this morning. Because it's the most podcast thing is to not know what episode you're on. Oh, yeah. I got I got on the, on the dock right there. 181. Nice. Hell yeah. I already got a title for this shit. Holy I'm fucking ready to go. You are prepared. I am prepared. But that's only because of Shun. And I had a meeting today about the podcast. So Nice. What was... <laughs> It was, what were the notes? Uh, well, we were trying to figure out because there. Okay, we have this thing. We've been at it for a while. Podcast, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. One hundred eighty-one. One hundred eighty-one. Uh, and we found that. Well, when there's a lot of serious things happening in the on Earth, like very scary, serious things that are happening in like news. Yep. Oh, I'm aware. Yeah, I'm a person that's you know <laughs> yeah. that has taken a look at uh, online, mm-hmm. and uh, it's a nightmare. Yeah, and it's tough to like. It's really hard on podcasters because, <laughs> like, you don't want to. Oh yeah, I'm with you, buddy. Yeah, there's that's just nothing. Why I, that's why I'm stuck on episode 49 <laughs> of Mr. Friendship. The world is just too fucked up. Too fucked up, man. And, and I'm out of ideas. And, but, yeah, <laughs> you know. But yeah, no, I'm joking. Obviously, it's you know the there's the, the, the least of this is first world problems is what I'm saying. Yes, absolutely. but we just needed something to talk about, so we we're. Flipping through everything. We were going through Twitter. We were going through TikTok to find yeah. something to talk about. And then I remembered. I won't get into it yet. We'll get there later. Okay. But the no- every Monday we have a meeting about the podcast. What we talk about. This is a little behind the curtains look. Behind yep. the scenes. Hey, listen. I'm, uh, you're, I have uh, those meetings uh, every Monday as well. About my podcast? Your podcast. <laughs> I go, here's what Curtis should do. <laughs> and then... Uh, They're right before yeah. my meeting and Sean no, yeah. takes what you say and he relays yeah, it to me. And he relays me. it to you. Cause mm-hmm. I, and you know what? That's what... I, it's a stupid question that I asked. Because I know. Because <laughs> yeah. I'm the one who suggests all this. <laughs> you, Yeah, you're the, the man behind the curtain. Yeah, I'm the man behind the, the curtains, Connor. The Kurt, Yeah, behind the yeah, curtains. Exactly. At the... That's the thing. Pay no attention to the man behind the <laughs> <Yeah>. Curtis. <laughs> it's you with overalls on. Yeah. The Wizard of Jake. Uh, <laughs> speaking of, we got a guest today. <laughs> I didn't even introduce you. Who? <laughs> um, <clears throat> my best fucking buddy in the world, Jacob Sharp. Hey, everybody. He's here. I'm he back. Made it. I'm sorry. I, as much as I would love to have a separate, a third camera on Jacob, <clears throat> you guys... Got in my, I, I heard the comments, I saw them. You're like, when I did the episode of Dean, you were like, this kind of defeats the whole purpose of having a yeah, set if you can't you see them in the same well room. Done this on fucking Zoom. <laughs> yeah, and I get that. Yeah. <laughs> okay? So, now, look, at, we're both in the now, same room. We're both in the same room, but well, it's far away. Yeah. <laughs> you like that? Are you happy? Now we can do a crash Zoom, and it'll be super <laughs> pixelated. How do you like that? Yeah, because huh? we do not shoot in 4K. Okay? No, sorry. Sorry, so, bitch. Yeah, it's 1080p, and if I forget to modify the settings on Final Cut Pro, it might be 720p. It might Sorry. mess everything up. Sorry. Sorry. And I won't notice till I upload. Yeah, exactly. Until yeah. someone comments, and I go, fuck. Yeah. Look at me. Yeah. How, how often has it happened to you? It's happened to me a few times. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't learn your lesson. <laughs> no, well, recently I have. Yeah. Because it's when you do it enough times, that's mm-hmm. when that's when you go... Like I've left notes for myself. That's good to like, make sure that it's the make sure right. that I have to like make sure like twenty nine point nine seven frames a, frames. Yes, a exactly. Second. Make sure that it's an uh, at least uh, what is it nineteen twenty by ten eighty. Yeah, and then uh, nice aspect ratio aspect ratios plus ratio. But plus the one L. thing that I'm still not getting because mm-hmm. I'm not I because if you're like me and you uh you you procrastinate. And then you have to stay up all night editing. <laughs> because I, you know, I always make the joke that so I have funny. a video out tomorrow. I better get scripted. Oh, man. <laughs> I better I gotta I, sober up. I, <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, I got to start editing. Whoops. <laughs> uh, whoa, whoa. But so sometimes I don't take enough time to go through uh, if the audio is clipping or not. Because, you know, right. sometimes like you're you're just in it. chop something and then yeah. uh, and then. Because sometimes Final Cut will fuck up, mm-hmm. and it'll like make a clipping sound, 
and then you look through yeah. it again and it's not there anymore. Right. But then sometimes when it like renders and exports like the actual like master file, yeah. It'll have like it'll have places that are like that are just clipping, which is like Yeah. That's... And then you look through it, but then there's no like sound like piece of sound there. Right. Yeah. So I know that's like the annoying thing. So you have to like I know that's the you have worst to part. you have to export it, yeah. Listen to it, watch and it then again. go back in and make the notes of where it is. <laughs> the thing is, when you export a video, the last thing you want to do is watch it in its entirety because you just spent the last fuck like thirty hours listening to it over yep. and over again. So you're like, it's fine. Oh, and it's the it's the last thing you want to do. Even like for example, like the same thing is like when you do uh like stand up and you record your set, the last thing you you want to do is listen to it. And I know we should to get better. But there's a part of me (laughs) that doesn't want to get better, and I just just want to stay the same because listening to my own voice is like, I've gotten, I think, better with it, with editing. (laughs) Yeah, you kind of have to. It's like forces you, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. You have to. Well, and to like, because at the end of the day, Mm -hmm. it's bananas that, we just sit in front of a camera and talk to it like it's a person yeah. or multiple people. Right. It and is it, insane. It, and Even it, this and, is you know, insane. At the end of the too, day, it does yeah. go to someone's computer. Right. But it still feels weird. Yeah, it's definitely not like what we are supposed to be doing. Yeah. <laughs> like it's humans not, it's are not, not supernatural. No. But, it's uh, supernatural. But here I am complaining like uh, like like it matters. Like, yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> But uh, it's yeah, not I guess I need to work harder. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's the lesson here. I guess I here. need to work harder. Huh? The lesson here is Jacob needs to work hard. Actually, and no, I don't think so. Well, I think you need to work smarter. Smarter. <laughs> and I, 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 you saw my new agenda today. Yeah. And I've been writing out what I need to do each day and yeah. crossing it out with a pink highlighter. That's good. Because it, it makes it fun for me. It's bright and colorful. Uh, and then Eilish has made me like office hours. Dang. Because so, I'm, I don't know, I, I'm a bad boss for myself. Yeah, I'm, same, I'm well, the worst. I'm a good boss because I'm like, relaxed. I'm like, I'm like, you worked hard last week, <laughs> yeah. take the rest of the week off. Yeah. And then. That video's not out till Friday, it's yeah, Monday, it's man, Monday. you got time. Go play three days of video games. <laughs> go to bed, who yeah, cares? Yeah, fuck it, who cares, you're fine. Yeah. Yeah, go buy some shirts. Yeah, exactly, yeah, <laughs> go online, yeah. go buy yourself a shirt. <laughs> Use your computer, but Use don't your, work. Yeah, don't, don't do it. <laughs> yeah. But then, like, think of an idea, don't write it down, mm-hmm. and then scramble. Yeah. It's, like, the best thing you can do. Yeah, it is. I got to do that, too, man. I got to. That was, like, that's, like, my resolution. I said I talked about this last week, but I'm trying to, like, it should not fucking work all the time. Yeah, man. Because I shouldn't, I shouldn't have to, you know? But that's the thing is like if we worked smarter, we would have more time. Yeah, we wouldn't of... so be we wouldn't be so goddamn fucking tired all the time. Oh yeah, it's we crazy wouldn't... when you eat when you have three coffees and a Wendy's chicken sandwich and you feel like shit. It's so weird. Sorry, buddy. Four coffees. Four coffees. <laughs> I had four coffees today. Yeah, that's do you is that a, do you usually have that much coffee in a day? Yeah, four a day. Like no problem. <laughs> Eilish will be weirded out because she'll be like, I'll have a coffee before bed. And I'll still yeah. pass out, no problem. <laughs> but I, I think I think I'm a bit of an anomaly because you, you've you've you we live together and you've, yeah, you've known just, me for the past eight years. Yeah, and, if there's uh, one guy who could fall, fall asleep, asleep anywhere, no matter where or when or what you're doing, it is it is Jacob Andrew Sharp. Oh yeah, you put me on a warm bus, I am out cold. God, yeah, no problem. Class sleeping, <laughs> watching it, dude. Watching a movie, Any, yeah. <laughs> And if it's a movie I want to see, I'm probably falling asleep right away. Yeah. The, An action movie, it doesn't matter. Yeah, it's crazy that you've seen any movie. Yeah. it Well, it takes me a few tries sometimes. <laughs> like That's why I like the theater, because the right. theater can keep me awake. I've fallen asleep in the theater. I'm not going to lie. That doesn't surprise me at all. I fell yeah. asleep uh, in Lincoln twice. Got woken up. I mean, that's kind of the movie that I'd... Yeah. yeah, but it's like it's like a, like a really... like intense movie action uh, well not movie. really action it's just daniel day lewis like action supernatural and action yeah movie. yeah it's kind of like paranormal activity but abraham lincoln. <laughs> it's like van helsing <laughs> <laughs> but abraham van lincoln <laughs> van wilder this van- time it's abe lincoln 
<laughs> Van Wilder featuring Van Helsing. Yeah. Ryan Reynolds is Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be a fucking sick I would watch that. I would, watch I that would never fall asleep during that movie. <laughs> Van Wilder. I forgot about that. Is that because it's... Is that Vancouver? Is it short for Vancouver? Yeah, Vancouver Wilder. Because he he's in Vancouver. from Vancouver. Yeah, Vancouver. I think that's really funny, buddy. Is he... He is Van Wilder, right? Yes. Right? That's, yeah. And, uh... I gotta look it up. Yeah, he's in there. He's the guy. He's Van and, uh, Wilder. Uh, Tara Reed is the love interest, and then uh... yeah, Ryan Reynolds is Van Wild. Oh, Cal Penn, you're Cal good... Penn. Yeah, Cal Penn plays his. Uh... Isn't that your good friend? My close personal friend, Cal Penn. <laughs> Apparently, he came back to Bangarang uh, recently. Oh, really? Was he looking for you? I don't think so. Uh-huh. But him and I would talk and hang out, and I would serve him drinks. He was a really nice guy. That's pretty cool. And, uh, okay, Van Wilder, The Rise of Taj. Rise that of, looks oh, like it's yeah. the, that's the second one? Yep, The Rise of Taj. Oh, and fucking Aaron Samuels is in the other one. Wow. Who the fuck's Van, Aaron Samuels? You know from Oh, mean Aaron Samuels? Like his, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I don't know the actor's name. Yeah, okay. Sorry. Yeah. He also hosts yeah, a lot of... Van Wilder with John Tucker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just... Man. National Lampoons. Yeah. Guys, guys from movies. From like the like mid two thousands. All the, yeah, they are just mix and match all yeah, of them. Absolutely, same guy every time. Yeah. Every, what was the mo- Easy A with Penn Bagley? What's his character's name? Penn Badgley. Pen, is that was that his name? I think it's Badgley. Oh. Penn Pen, Badgley. Penn Badgley. Badgley. Penn uh, and then like I bet his name is also like Aaron Samuels. It was like, all Aaron Samuels. The, all those guys <laughs> in those movies. Yeah. The same guy. Van Helsing or something. Van Helsing. The high school student Van Helsing. Van Helsing. <laughs> Always killing vampires instead of going I, to class. You've seen that movie, right? Van Helsing with yeah. Hugh Jackman. Yeah, yeah. I used to watch Van Helsing like three times a week. <laughs> <laughs> that that doesn't shock me. Yeah. I've seen it a few times. Yeah. But like I lo- I had the Van Helsing video game. I loved Van Helsing. Yep. Uh, also because uh Kate Beckinsale was in it. Oh and yeah. She was very pretty. She was very pretty. That is yeah. That is the movie where you're like like well, how old were we? Probably like uh, 10 or 11. Yeah, I still lived in Whitby, so I was like 10. Yeah, probably 10. 10, 10 or 11, like, 12 maybe. Kate Beckinsale in that movie, that is the like that is the 10-year-old like, fantasy. W- like when you're like <laughs> The ma- the ten year old gaze, yes, yeah, yeah. <laughs> is Kate Beckinsale and Van Helsing, yeah. Uh, but like that's the time when you're like, like I think that's the time in movies where you're like, uh, you're you're not like you don't really I don't know if you understand I don't know if I understood attraction, but right. I was like, I, I like I I I, li- I like her, mm-hmm. yeah. Like, like I, 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 I have a crush on I like her, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sabrina, throw up a picture of Kate Beckinsale in Van Helsing, please, but. With her holding hands with me. <laughs> no, no, yeah, no. Yeah, with me, not Curtis, me. You can't. Yeah, you can. I'm getting cucked on my own pod. Yeah, sorry, buddy. Me and Kate <laughs> going to cuck. <laughs> no. Kate and Jake plus cuck. <laughs> <laughs> a new TLC show. Yeah, the new TLC show. One where... episode long. Yep, and it's just Curtis crying. <laughs> <laughs> you don't actually see the... No. I do, but no one else. Well, it's also it. a podcast episode. <laughs> yeah. Just audio. <laughs> on TLC. <laughs> on TLC. Airing on TLC. Yeah, they're moving into podcasts. Yeah. On TV, though. On TV. Yeah, absolutely. Yo, that's and, an untapped market right there. Podcast, but t- on TV. Yeah, so putting, you can watch it on demand. So it kind of. Yeah. So it airs think, at like 7 p.m., a podcast episode. So, okay. Here's. Okay. But here's. brings This brings me to a thing. Well, Netflix. Yes. The Raising point of, your hand. The point, hi. <laughs> yeah. You have Curtis? a question. You could just say it. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, dude. Yeah, I remember oh, that. Dude holding the arm. I have a holding, fucking pick holding me. the arm up because like You're my so little tired. like my little eight year old body couldn't <laughs> yeah. couldn't take that much. Like this is a huge workout. Yeah. Also, this doesn't do that much. It no. really doesn't help. No, it just it like doesn't. it just keeps this arm up. Now. Yeah. The, both our arms are tired. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> But so Netflix, uh, any uh, streaming platform mm-hmm. is meant to be like you can watch whatever you want, whenever you want. Right. Like, so you like, but then they brought back the like weekly episode thing. They like yeah, brought back true. TV. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. That is weird. 
Because that, that was the whole appeal of it, is like binge watching was like the thing that was like, exactly. that's what we do now. But then they were like, well, no, we need to bring some sort of like surprise element. Yeah. I don't know what it would be like. They were like, I guess maybe like people were blowing through content too I easily. I guess. Yeah. I mean, I do understand. I like the anticipation and stuff like that's yeah. fun. But they're like, when they brought that back, I was kind of like, well, mm. then commercials are right behind it. Yeah, commercials are gonna like it'll. We'll just have TV again. We'll just have TV again. Yeah. It's just now we have to pay <laughs> it's a full circle. And like, isn't it funny that TV used to be? Yeah, we've got like six thousand channels. Yeah, and now <laughs> it's like, yeah, I have eight different streaming services. Right, and it's the same thing though. Like, like we a would couple pay hundred how, each one, exactly, and now it like, adds and up like, to that. Yeah, so it, you're it, paying it, probably more than cable probably, for the most part, probably. But then it's like the. uh yeah, what is, like, the illusion of choice, really? Well, it's, like, it, not the illusion, but, like, the, I don't know. You can pick whatever you want, but it's, like, there's, like, at what point it's, like, there's so much. And that's where I think free will is too stressful. Yeah. I don't, like, that's where <laughs> Show, that put, version of free will I don't like. I want put on what I, what I should watch, and that's yeah. it. There should be one show. There should be one show, one <laughs> channel, and yeah. I just have to watch it. Because right. that type of free will is way too stressful. Yeah. I mean, I do understand why they do the weekly things just in like a monetary stance, I guess. Because like if you for like Moon Knight, the new show that's coming out on Disney Plus with Oscar Isaac, the new Marvel one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's six episodes. So say, for example, they started. If they do the first of one month that comes out. Yeah. You have to wait to two months. You have to give them at least two months of. True, of right. Revenue, of like a monthly subscription. Right. So if there's like one show, you start a free trial, you binge it, and then you say you cancel it. So it's like maybe that's so. why they do the weekly thing. That um, makes way more sense. Yeah. But other than that, it's just like, yeah, this is just TV again. TV, yeah, TV, TV again. two. Yep. And like, cool, you, like we used to, uh, when you had satellite or cable, it was like, yeah, I have like a billion channels. Yeah. And it's like, <laughs> Half okay. of them were like, what what even they were like German or something yeah it's like but that's the same (laughs) as streaming platforms like yeah oh there's like I have there's like six billion movies on Netflix yeah but like a hundred of them are good (laughs) yeah yeah exactly maybe yeah and only like four of them are really like trending right now I'm just watching it so I can talk to other people about it and I've seen the hundred that are good and I rewatch them all the time because they're Harry Potter right (laughs) that's the only thing I watch because they're Harry Potter Mm -hmm. uh you hear about the new Harry Potter video game no is it going to be... I hope it's just a remake of the PS1 one. PS1 game. Not PS1 one. one? PS11? PS11? PS1001. Sorry. One I, zero. Sorry, speaking binary when it comes sorry, to the Harry sorry, Potter games. Sorry. Yeah. PS11011? One 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 one? It's just the original, like, uh, Prisoner of Ascot. Or, sorry, the Sorcer- Philosopher's Stone? Yeah. Sorcerer's Stone, are you fucking yeah, Americans? Yeah, Americans. Yeah. Sorry, guys. We don't know what a philosopher yeah. is. Yeah. Sorry, bruv. Also, it's so... I've, Okay, what was the logic behind? I feel like I've talked about this in my podcast before, but Americans don't understand philosopher, but they understand sorcerers. Yep, exactly. Well, like, <laughs> <laughs> like guys, but, who, not even like a magician, a sorcerer, a sorcerer. That's crazy. But also, even for me, yeah, f- like a philosopher is like like a philosopher and a sorcerer are very two different, different things. things. Yeah, you're gonna tell me that like Gandalf and Socrates are the same <laughs> yeah. guy? Yeah, like, Plato, that's, the sorcerer. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, that doesn't make sense. <laughs> True. Also, they don't. I don't think they say it in the. They didn't like read film the movie for Americans and say sorcerers in it, right? No, they didn't. But they did remake the book. That's so fucking weird. Was there like but, one focus group that they did, and they were like, "We don't know what a philosopher." Is. I, but I, I, feel I, I like bet. Probably. I bet. I bet someone was like, "No." It made more sense if it was a sorcerer. I went to school. I majored in sorcery. It's sorcery one hundred and one. <laughs> 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 Sorcery 101. I mean, yeah, that's my minor this year. This <laughs> minor year. in sorcery? Sor- yeah, minor yeah, in sorcery. I majored, majored in, in a- philosophy. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, double majored in secrets. In secrets. <laughs> in a, in yeah, a I did a double major in Azkaban. <laughs> uh, yeah, but, true. So, oh, I had a point to that. Oh, I, do you know the, the show Money Heist? Uh, I've heard of it. Yeah. So it, the show is uh span. It's 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 in Spanish. Okay. And I think, and uh, you can but they they have an English dub. Okay. But then you can put on the English subtitles. The English subtitles are a direct translation, 
and then the dub is like an Americanized translation. Right. Okay. So like they instead of saying prime minister, which is what the direct, uh, for example, the the direct. Uh, translation was prime minister mm-hmm. but then the american dub was president president right because they were like trying to c- cater to u.s yeah, audiences what the fuck is a prime minister exactly yeah. even though in europe it's like everyone's a prime minister mm-hmm. everybody's a prime everybody's minister. a prime minister <laughs> we're all prime ministers <laughs> especially in canada especially in canada i am prime minister trudeau i am prime minister jacob andrew sharp uh but, but yeah you should look up the the harry potter video game it looks sick okay it's like supposed to be like an open world type thing where you're and, just a fucking wizard and you go around to cast spells. Honestly, fuck J.K. Rowling, but like Harry Potter's kind of gas. Yeah, what the fuck's wrong with her? She's weird. Has bad opinions. <laughs> yeah, just and like, like, like you that she reads enough of the comments online that she's like, okay, no one really likes me, and then she's like, I know how to fix it. <laughs> I'll just claim random characters <laughs> as gay, and yeah. I think no one will notice. Yeah. That's, you know Scabbers? He's actually gay. Yeah, he's gay. Scabbers is yeah, bi, actually. Scabbers is bi. Uh, <laughs> like, dude, <laughs> hey, JK. Yeah. Hey, just kidding, Rowling. <laughs> hey, J- hey J- just JK Rafflecopter. Why don't you <laughs> figure it out? Why don't you? Yeah, it's so weird kook. to like retro, retroactively claim people's sex. And they're like, who asked? Yeah. It, who cares if Dumbledore cares? fucking sucked cock? I okay, don't care. cool. Like, that's, that's awesome. That's awesome. You're going to write about and it? And also, if you're going to do that, then when you, like the movie, uh, what with the fucking second Fantastic Beasts, mm-hmm. they like introduce young Dumbledore and it's like, okay, well, if, hey, if right. you're going to introduce that, True. Then, like, if you're going to be all like, yeah, he's gay and stuff, why don't you do talk it. about it in the movie then? Yeah. Why don't you prove it? Prove... <laughs> Prove it. <laughs> yeah, prove it. JK, what the fuck's you... Put your like, money where your mouth yeah, is. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's bullshit. Also, yeah, it's... Fuck, I forgot what I was going to say, too. And JK also, she like, just weird. doesn't believe in, like, trans rights and shit. Right. Yeah, fucking... What is it called? Turf or whatever? Trans yeah. exclusionist something feminist? Uh, Yeah, fucking weirdo. Weirdo. Writes a mean book about uh about magicians, though. Magicians. Sorcerers. Sorcerers. And philosophy. And <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, well, we could... Uh, let's well, change. she's probably so old that she probably met Socrates and Plato. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Bitches. Okay, let's change the subject here. We can't hear the sound effect, but it is playing. What was it? Just my changing sound, the oh. sound effect. Changing subject sound effect. From A little segue. Mm-hmm. Beep, beep. It's like... Oh, yeah, I know. It's yeah. from Goat Story. So, okay, I brought something nice for us to look at, for, to react to. Okay. Um, Classic React Bros video. <laughs> Whatever, what's their, that's that guy, those guys' name? Oh, uh, Fine Bros? Fine Bros. Yeah. Fine Bros react to yeah. this. C- Curtis and Jacob react yeah. to that. We're the real Fine Bros. Because mm-hmm. you know I mean? we're fine, bro. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm fucking talking about. Fucking okay. <laughs> um, oh, geez, I was on. I didn't get to meet them, but I was on their channel. Oh yeah, I did the YouTubers yeah. reacting at VidCon, and it was. Is it fun? I guess I just watched videos, and then I was like, "That was crazy." Nice. And then they were like, "All right, courtesy later." That's like all of YouTube, though. Oh yeah, that's like that's what we uh, do. Yeah, that's yeah. What we do. I said, "Thank you." We did you. that today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. They said, "Thank you for your time." I said, "No problem." And then I got fucked up. Nice. Got drunk as shit. Yeah. Hell yeah. It was pretty cool. Um. Everyone else was getting fucked up, so it's fine. I wasn't getting fucked get up alone drunk at VidCon by yourself after a collab. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, people they have to like drink to 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 get ready to do things before. I do you it after. Get you get drunk to digress. Yeah, to, to reflect. Yeah, to reflect and to uh, you know wind down. Yeah. <laughs> wind down. I get belligerent. You get blackout. To, uh, wind down. Yeah, that actually, is probably pretty true for some people. But. Yeah, that's true. I get I wind down by putting some wine wind down. down. Absolutely. Um. Anyways, <laughs> uh, we've me and Jacob. We've we've speaking of YouTube. We've uh, we've we've reacted to some people. To some we have dabbled. We yeah. have reacted. We have. Uh, we did know, that Urban Legends video on my channel. We did Mario sh- stuff, stuff on your on my channel. channel. And there's we also did. another person. Oh, we did JD vlogs. We did JD vlogs. Is that um, we did? We did Nate Garner. A Nate yeah, Garner we did video. Nate and Carissa. He was yeah, box his girlfriend for <laughs> yeah. some reason. Yeah, 
Classic Nate. Classic Nate. Um, also, he's like a Jake anti Nate plus he's, eight. Eight fists. Yep. <laughs> uh, boxing. <laughs> uh, Nate Garner, he's like a hardcore anti vaxxer now. Oh, Shocker. big shock. Big shock, a piece of shit guy did something even more piece of shit. <laughs> huh. Um, What's next? Who? I don't even want to know. I don't, know. I don't care. He, uh, he. Yeah, so we made a lot of videos, but there's also another person that we made videos about. Now, you might not have seen it, though. It's pretty pretty niche. Yeah. It's pretty... probably like our least popular video. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Uh, and it's a little guy named Sebastian Balls. Balls. We do not say his real name. No. Because it's all we do, because his real name is Sebastian Balls. What are you going to tell me that his real name is something else? It's Balls. It's Balls. It's... It's Sebastian Skittles Hair Army Cash Balls. Well, Army Cat, yeah, yeah, Army Cash <laughs> Balls. Cash yeah, balls. it is. Um, yeah. He makes my balls go Skittles color. Yeah, there you go. Put that in your memes. Call back and send it to me. <laughs> send it to me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so a lot has happened since the last video we made about Sebastian. Yeah. Uh, he, him, and is it Lauren? Lo- yeah, maybe. Sebastian Balls and Lauren. Yeah, it's Lauren. Lauren. I said Laura earlier. Yeah. I'm embarrassed. <laughs> it's okay. It's fine. Am I even a real stan? <laughs> That's fucking embarrassing, dude. It's fucking embarrassing. Dude, dude, I pop up when you search their names. That's hilarious. That's jokes. But um, I don't. Come on! <laughs> yeah, that's fucked up. I'm sure if you scroll down far enough. Yeah. But oh, what the what fuck? Okay. Well, they broke up. <gasps> Crazy. They broke up a few months ago. Um... You know, just wasn't working out. Um, and then yeah. Sebastian moved away. He moved out of California somewhere. I don't know where, but he bought a house. Whoa. With all that fucking cash he was making from pretending to be in the army. <laughs> pretending to be, yeah. And, well, uh, you know, pretending to, to tr- hit his girlfriend. Yeah, and pretending to be, he's saying that he doesn't want to wait anymore and forcing his girlfriend to have sex with him. Yeah, crying because he was going to die of COVID. Yeah. His oh, yeah. Got his dad, it. I forgot about that. <laughs> I'm gonna uh, fucking die. And he didn't say COVID, right? He said COVID. COVID nineteen. COVID nineteen. <laughs> the COVID nineteen. The COVID of nineteen. The nineteenth COVID. <laughs> Brovid. Bro- <laughs> Brovid. Brovid. Brovid nineteen. Um, but out of nowhere, okay. He used uh he the, the last video. I'll go to his channel real quick. So, so you he can see did he him. take a hiatus then? He took a hiatus because uh, I'll be honest, I haven't been keeping up. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay, so, yeah, he was, they broke up, I think, fucking, when was it? Okay, so yeah, he uploaded the video that he took down, he re-uploaded it, which is fucked up. Um, oh, the one that, like, we called him out for? Yeah. No way! He put it fucking back up. He needs that sweet, sweet ad revenue. Nice. Ignoring my girlfriend for 24 hours. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Hacking into middle school Zoom classes. Um, okay, so one year ago they broke up. Okay. The okay. truth about our breakup. And so then I was going to make the suggestion that when I went into remission for cancer, that that's when they broke up. <laughs> because when I was okay, that's when they had to stop. Yeah, that they had I've to. I've said it a few times, and I don't have any proof, mm-hmm. but I think you showing me their videos might have... Given you... Yeah, you know, giving done, you giving me cancer. some sort of illness. It definitely I, didn't help. Uh, no, <laughs> and my doctors told me stop watching this guy's videos. <laughs> um, so they broke up. Crazy, surgically removing our matching tattoos. <laughs> <laughs> and then, Man. <laughs> and then he did an empty house tour, which is uh so sad. Oh God. Um, why? And- wh- I like. <sighs> Why lean into the, like, why be, like, the most, why why cater your content to be, like, a divorced <laughs> guy? Yeah. Empty house tour. Yeah. She took fucking everything. Yeah. My next video, I'm going to show you how empty and sad my fridge is. <laughs> like, um, but then, nothing for a year. Radio silence. Okay? No. And then, out of the blue, Sebastian returns. Yo. What with a video we- one month ago. Why I left YouTube finally coming out and telling the truth. Whoa. So, pretty heavy. Whoa. So, let's see. Let's see what it's all about. 
I owe you guys honesty and it's finally time that I come out and tell you guys the truth. Part of me just feels so guilty and ashamed. I'm no longer single. I met somebody and honestly in a really, really happy relationship. So he does still does the fucking thing. The trailer fucking where it's like where it's like, here's what the video is about. <laughs> yeah. Like, so you gotta grab their attention, man. Yeah, man, that's true. You gotta get that like, first that's what ten they teach seconds. You in content one oh one class. Yeah. We we are we are we majored in content. Yeah. Minored in minored sorcery. Minored in sorcery, but <laughs> majored in content. <laughs> I'm still trying to complete my degree. But... <laughs> Starting to think I got scammed. Yeah, I think yeah. <laughs> I think online Hogwarts was a real thing, I yeah, guess. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Zoom Hogwarts. Yeah, the magic of crash zooms. <laughs> All right. Oh my gosh. You're spraying your camera, man. It has been way too long since I've seen your guys' faces. I have not posted on... That's not how YouTube works. You don't... Also... Is the truth that you got Tony Stark's glasses? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> True. Yeah, the like, same thing. It's ridiculous to say that I'm going to tell you guys, like, that I'm going to spill the tea on my life. Mm -hmm. Here's the truth. Here's what's happening. And then to put on those glasses. <laughs> yeah. I, those blue tinted sunglasses. This is a Bono in, like, a Sever universe. Yes. Like, this is, like, <laughs> uh, yeah, like, what's the truth? I'm Bono now? <laughs> Yeah, exactly. I'm now in charge I'm now... of Stark Industry and <laughs> execute them all. Yeah. <laughs> also, dude, look at those Oreos in the back. Look how they're stacked in those jars. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, like those are Oreos. Oh my god, they're like uniformly stacked. I know that there's like I'm sure that like on TikTok, like that would get like him stacking those would get like five billion likes or something. Oh, for sure. To I'm actually like... have it like that though, what do you? You can't eat them. You take and one Oreo. Like... Away. I think I know what my centerpiece for my kitchen is going to be. <laughs> These Oreos. Golden Oreos. And then Oreos. Like, someone goes together and be like, don't touch that. Don't no, touch no, no, that. No, don't touch it. Those are for show. <laughs> They're not real Oreos. No. And I have the golden ones there, too. You can eat the golden ones. You can't don't eat the regular ones. Don't touch the middle ones. I can don't do without so. the goldens. Yes. I can, <laughs> I can replenish those. I can't find regular Oreos anymore. <laughs> That's such a weird problem to have. Like weird. I can only find gold. I can only orders. find the gold ones and sometimes the cinnamon roll ones. I won't tell you where I moved, but where where I moved, moved? it is hard right, to find like, regular yeah. Oreos. Yes, the <laughs> I can buy terrible sunglasses, exactly. but I cannot find regular oh, Oreos. Oh yeah, I've got bags and bags of these sunglasses. And that's what I've been eating the whole time. I only eat sunglasses now. I can't stop puking. <laughs> Shitting blood. I would love a regular Oreo, but I can't. I can't find them. <laughs> Uh, okay. <laughs> really nitpicking here. Look at these yeah. fucking cookies in the Look background. These cookies, you idiot. <laughs> just mean. In 278 days. This Whoa. is the longest break I've ever taken since I've started social media. So the question is, why did I stop? <laughs> yeah. Same intro. Right back, man. I think I'm gonna set you guys up right here. This should be good. I'm so happy to announce that today's video is sponsored by CapCut. Literally oh, come on, bro. Dude, a bookend sponsor. Thank you guys so much for. What the heck? There's like something breaking into Also, putting his feet on there for free. Oh, yep. 100%. Can't be, can't be doing that, Sebastian. Can't be doing that, brother. Fumbled the bag yeah, yet absolutely. again. Yeah, we're going to be sponsored by the money I'm going to make off these feet picks. <laughs> uh, okay. Hilarious, man. Oh, your friend came over. Dude, hey. Hey, like, YouTubers like this. I don't give a fuck about you giving your friend a car or, like, your friend. And I, think, I know that I'm... I think this is him. Oh. This is him doing, like, a special oh, a edit. screen. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Okay, okay. Also, forget everything I said because I am the friend, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I never gave you anything. That's true. You never gave me a car. <laughs> I know. I gave you fucking cancer because of this yeah, guy. Man. Giving my friend cancer Dude, vlog. Like, this is still the ad. This is, oh, the ad's still like, what are we, seven minutes in? Hold on. When did it start? Oh, like 50 the ad is him coming. Okay. This is a minute. Okay, oh, a minute and a half. Boy. That's normal. Okay, here we go. Fuck. Regular programming. 
Always skip YouTubers' ads, except for ours. Yeah, please do not. <laughs> also, like... Come on. What? Dude! What okay, saying? these autofills has... Why hasn't Sebastian Bales been on YouTube? Why hasn't Sebastian Bales been married? Why hasn't Sebastian Bales been in jail? Why hasn't Sebastian Bales been on TV? That's so funny. Okay, man, relax. Nobody missed you, man. Sorry. <laughs> He's acting For like it's like this crazy like return. One of the hardest videos I've okay. ever filmed. Oh, part of me just feels so guilty and ashamed of why I've waited so long to come out and say this. Oh, I just need to just like let it out and just say it and get it off my chest and finally move on. I've never opened up about this, not to my family or nor to my closest friends because I just truly just don't ever want anyone really concerned about my well-being. So when I stopped posting on social media, I didn't really give an explanation of why I stopped. I just completely stopped and I did that because I just truly did not think anyone would really care. But that all changed when I started to get messages and comments and DMs and emails about where I've been and Cap. why I've been so inactive. Yeah. And Cap. Cap. I don't think anyone fucking sent you anything. Man, like... I don't think anybody sent him any messages. No, I, because I'll be honest, there's no way that, like, the 10-year-olds that watch his videos are allowed <laughs> to, like, DM a grown man and be like, where are you? Where are you? I miss you. Jesus Christ. And essentially, why I stopped posting on YouTube. After a lot of thought, I've now realized that I truly owe you guys an explanation. And okay, then fucking say it, man. We're yeah, halfway like, through. A seven-minute video, we're halfway through, and what, he hasn't said it yet. What, what's the timestamp right now? 3.34. Okay. So halfway, pretty much. He already said, just say it, get it off your chest. <laughs> it's Is that just, important? It's just say it, man. Is that important? It's all good. It's all good, man. And, oh, hey... I can't, I hate to be this guy, but if you're going to do like a serious video where you're finally saying your stuff, mm -hmm. finally opening up about something, why is it monetized? Yeah, why well, you got an ad in there too? Yeah. Most of the video is an ad. I, well, most of the video is, it absolutely. And it's like, it's like when people put ads in like apologies and shit and like mm -hmm. how to monetize. Yeah. Oh, which I don't he, think you're that sorry. Which yeah. he's, yeah, he's done. Mm-hmm for me to be completely open and honest. So pretty much to give like a whole backstory of like why I stopped posting and why I quit YouTube, we have to go back to why I left LA. When yeah. Well, you don't really have, you just say that. You just, yeah. We don't have to go back. We don't need to go, so it all we don't need a whole story. Just tell us what the fucking grade. thing is. And I left LA. <laughs> I, hey, Curtis? Yeah? I'm starting to think that it's going to be nothing. And also, uh, his hair looks like a hat. <laughs> now he's wearing a hat here. Yeah, His but, hat before, looks like a hat, but, but before, before it did look like hair a hair looked like a hat. Hair looked like a hat. Hat looked like a hat. Yeah, hat looks like a hat. Also, that dog looks photoshopped. Yeah, <laughs> I didn't look real. but like, imagine like, is that how red your sweater is? Is that when you have an animal beside it, it looks fake? I Dude, he... that's the reddest sweater I've ever seen. <laughs> yeah. Also, I think he up nails in a red sweater. He ups the saturation like crazy in all yeah, his videos. Yeah, for sure. There's no even the Home Depot logo is like burning yeah. my eyes. Even Home Depot message him was like, "Hey, can you chill? Can you that's calm not down? Brand safe. That's not yeah, our like, color. That's not our color at all. <laughs> it doesn't. Okay, so that might be a fake dog. Here ago, okay, I it's real. In a very very dark place. Not only was I leaving LA because it was just a very toxic environment for me and put me through a lot of depression, but I was also going through a breakup, as you guys know. And I think know. just the combination <laughs> of these two things when I left LA and the breakup, it was just a lot to handle. So much so that I physically could not take it anymore. So as I'm trying to figure out why I'm feeling the way I'm feeling, I am still posting on YouTube. I did a few videos, not very many. It wasn't until my house tour that I realized that I just was not happy posting on YouTube anymore. It was because of me truly inside. And I've just pushed it away and kept it dormant for so long and ignored the fact that I really needed to work on myself. So, I Hey, if you're dealing with mental health issues, I, hey, that's I get great. It. That's yeah. To, to I'm not, I'm I mean, good. it's not great, but no, it's, you know, it's, but to be open about that, that's, Hey, good for you. Good job. I hope you, I hope you're doing better. Yeah. Uh, you know, that's great to recognize that stuff and work on it. But where was this when you were doing all your crazy fucked up shit? Yeah. Like, 
No, oh. th- no, no, no thought in your head to be like, yeah, maybe I should chill. Yeah, maybe I should calm down a little bit because, yeah. like, I don't know, I, I'm not happy. Right. And if I'm perpetuating this unhappiness mm-hmm. with the job I'm doing, yeah, you know, and I get that it's hard to get out of those cycles. That's for sure. But yeah, I don't know. Maybe like, uh, yeah, I'm sure it causes a bit of tension when you make a video ignoring my girlfriend for 24 hours. Absolutely. That might cause some tension in your relationship. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure you're having some weird friendships because you're doing hidden camera videos where you pretend, pretend to, to be- abuse your girlfriend. Yeah, of course you're going to have some mental health problems. Yeah. that's not going to be good for your yeah. for and your brain. I get that. Hey, uh, yeah, sure, Ellie. I'm sure Ellie's wicked fake. Yeah, but I don't know if this guy's the realest guy on planet Earth. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I wouldn't describe Sebastian Balls as grassroots, <laughs> but like. <laughs> Hey, I don't know him, so I don't know. But I'm just waiting for him to say, like, you know, I was in L.A., I wasn't happy, I got caught in a windstorm, my hair won't come down. <laughs> like, it's... I yeah. will say this is probably, the like, the the craziest I've seen his hair. It's getting out of control, yeah. I fell it's, into, like, this vat of uh, this radioactive orange juice, and now my skin yeah, won't get back to and normal. and then I fell into another vat of dippity doo gel, <laughs> and now... And now I have purple light bulbs on my bedside table. Yeah. So I took it upon myself to take a break from YouTube for my mental health because Let's go. I was very sad and just very lost. I was truly having an identity crisis. That is why I was orange. Um, that is why I literally left LA. That is why just so many things happened. I didn't even realize that I was going through an identity crisis. For the sure. problem is, is when I started social media, I was 16. Because now your hair is its natural color. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe even 15. I am now 22, almost 23 years old. And throughout my entire career on social media and YouTube, I have just kind of kept this personality of myself that I was when I was younger. I thought that's how I had to be to entertain you guys. And I was just so afraid to really show my true self on camera like I am right now. Because ultimately my hyper, over the top, crazy, exaggerated self is truly me. And that was once 100% me. I dragged that on for many, many years, and it became to the point that I was literally portraying to be my younger self. So essentially, I have evolved and I've matured a lot, and I'm still definitely crazy, wild, and hyper, and oh my god, what's up? I'm definitely like that, but it's just <laughs> not all the time. Awesome. Not Thank god he's back. Life, Thank there he is. Not everything is crazy and wild, and I really would like to show the reality of my life. So throughout this Great. whole 10 month process of figuring out who I am, going through therapy and so much, and just working on myself essentially, I have now found my truest and authentic self, and that could is- this be the redemption arc? Who knows? Maybe, yeah. Who I'm knows? also when he said, uh, you know, I would drag that stuff out, and I was uh, like, I, yeah. I, I, I get it, yeah, you, you know, you would you would over exaggerate yourself, mm-hmm. but uh, like you're not dragging something out right now. Right. This is dragging on like fucking crazy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you've. I don't drag it out. I, yeah, I'm sort yeah, of dragging. Even though, on but now. here's a seven minute video where I yeah. say nothing. It's so crazy to struggle to fill seven minutes because seven minutes yeah. is not that long no. for a YouTube video. That's no, but to get take this long to get to the thing, it, like I was expecting, like you know, finally coming out and telling the truth. I was thought I was thought it was going to be like. My ca- my fucking camera was stolen, and I yeah, yeah or my, like here's <laughs> like here's like a like Lauren and I went to court or like right. something where it's like <laughs> yeah whoa right now there's some truth yeah I was like I went to like uh went to England and became a knight or something yeah right? yeah, yeah. yeah and then you know and then I uh I don't know I beat up the queen yeah I got we really got good at archery fight. or something yeah yeah, yeah. yeah I got in, yeah I got really into archery. I thought I was Hawkeye for a little while. <laughs> I had to stop doing that because then I got into legal issues. I yeah. didn't know Hawkeye existed. <laughs> uh, I also, apparently, you can't just shoot people with arrows. No, for no you cannot. Reason. Not exploding arrows. That's no, for that's sure. for sure. And that's what I learned from <laughs> Hawkeye. But, like, yeah, you're, so far, the only truth is that, like... L.A. was tough. L.A. was tough, happy. and I had orange hair, and that is not me. Mm-hmm. So... Orange skin is me. <laughs> that's who I want to be online, and that's who I want to show you guys. But I just want to say that I am now finally so happy for the first time in my life in so long. 
And within this whole break from YouTube, I have not only worked on myself, but I've actually kind of gotten back into the dating scene. So when you guys last saw me in my last video, I was single and sad. But now in the present Jesus. day, I am happy to say that I am no longer single and I'm in a happy relationship. After my last breakup, I never thought I would ever be in a healthy relationship. I just truly believed I was going to be alone forever, but that is not the case. If you'd like to meet who I'm dating, um, let me know in the comments down below. But to answer we the big the huge question is, Am I okay? Yes, I'm obviously okay. And I'm doing so much better from the last time that you guys- Also, he said that like he's never opened up about this. Not even his family or his closest friends know about this. So they don't know that you're dating someone new? Is that like <laughs> and what they it don't, is? And they don't know that you like moved? Yeah. That's like- That's not good. That's, that's really not good a good- I don't know. That's Yeah, that's not a good report to have with your family where you don't feel comfortable telling them you moved <laughs> from LA. Yeah. They have no idea. They think I'm still there, dude. Also- I, I like I don't know if I fully believe that he didn't they moved away from LA. I mean he's probably still in California. And Well, uh, I don't know if he's buying a house. I don't know. He's not like unless his parents are super rich, but Jesus Christ. Man. On here and not be afraid to show you guys my life. Anywho, I'm rambling so much, but if you guys are new to this Okay. <laughs> that's enough. So um, that's all, that's it. That was the news? That was the big news that he returned for. Um I have a pretty big issue with the title. Yeah. Correct me if I'm wrong. Mm -hmm. But that is an example. The wording in the title, that must be an example of queer baiting. The choice of saying coming out. coming out and telling the truth. Yeah, that is an odd choice of words, right? I might be reaching here. And right. that's uh, so, you know. But yeah. it just feels like that was intentional. Yeah, I know what you mean. You yeah. know what I mean? Putting coming, coming out. Coming out, you can just say telling the truth. Yeah. But I, I, I don't know. I could be nitpicking. But right. I know. It just seems a little fishy to me. That is, yeah, that is kind of weird. And then to, and then the whole video is just like leading up to nothing and right. being like, I'm going to tell start, you guys something yeah. that my family doesn't know true. about. Something I've never felt comfortable That's about. true, yeah. Yeah, and also delete the video, Sebastian. Yeah, delete the video, man. I only made ninety dollars. All right, donate it. Yeah, <laughs> donate it, man. Donate the ninety dollars, man. Probably made more since you re-uploaded yeah. it. I'm a petty old bitch. I'm not over it. Donate the fucking money, man. Donate the money, man. Donate the money. It's still there. It's still there. Well, and that was well, wasn't that one of our points on like the last video is that he just he just makes it like private. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because yeah, just... it showed it on the thing. He made it private. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. So he didn't delete oh, it. Oh, yeah. He never did. Yo, that's fucked up. Send that clip to Sabrina. Yeah, I gotta find it. Find that clip, because we have proof that that guy said he deleted the video, but he just put it on private. Right. Just so years later, he could put it back up, keep getting AdSense on it. Damn. Fuck that guy, man. Honestly, want to literally removing the video right now on camera. So, as you guys can see, I now removed it to private, so no one can see the video. <laughs> Hold on! <laughs> yeah, fuck you, Sebastian. Fuck you, Sebastian. You had me for a second being like, okay, mental health, you're going to therapy and shit. You Maybe yeah. you're being better. But no, uh, dude. The video you made about abuse. Uh, until you take that video down. Yeah, I can't sympathize until you take that shit down, man. Yep. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> I mean, I hope you're doing better. But I for hope you're sure. better enough where you, you know, learn from your fucking shit. But, like, dude, okay, I have another theory. Mm -hmm. He might be the, like, long-lost son of Donald Trump. Yeah. Because I, the only other person I know on planet Earth with, like, that orange of skin <laughs> is Donald, Donald Trump. Trump. Yeah. And yo, just because... Uh, you might be right, actually. I think, you know, he's a, he's a fucking... He's a liar. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, uh, yeah. He uh, he says things that uh, I don't agree with sometimes, you know. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, he looks like a fucking a crazy hair. Yeah, cr yeah, the nuts hair, yeah. nuts so hair. <laughs> True, dyes his hair just like his fucking. Damn, that's yeah. uh, put that in your conspiracy, and uh, you know. Yeah, Shane Dawson, make a video yeah, about that, that, dude. Another guy that you know. No thanks. Yeah. Also, I just saw in the top right that's fucking. Collab right there. Collab. I'm oh. signed. I'm signed. Uh, they're the same same MCN, which sucks. What's MCN? 
Like a multi-channel network. Oh, are you a part of Collab? Yeah. Oh. Collab. Nice. Come on, guys. Get this guy out of here. Yeah, come on. <laughs> Get this guy out of here. Get this I mean, guy. they have like so many fucking people on their shit. Yeah. So so that was uh, that was Sebastian's return. What do you think? Uh, I'm disappointed. Yeah. I mean, I, I mean, what do we least, expect? At least give me the old Sebastian that I know and love. Yeah. Give me the old. Give me a crazy thumbnail. Yeah. Give me a prank that's like vaguely like you know rude or like disrespectful. Mm-hmm. Like, don't don't fucking don't clickbait me. You yeah. Why lets YouTube finally coming out? Yeah, you're right. That is a crazy thing. Finally to coming out <laughs> yeah. and telling the truth. Yeah. That has to be intentional. Yeah, you're right. That is pretty crazy to do that. Like, finally coming out? Yeah. Odd choice of words. Yeah. If it was intentional, that's wild. If it was unintentional, still, why did you like, pick those hey, words? Dude, come on. <laughs> uh, and also, I love that he's like, you know, like... And he's uh, crying in the thumbnail. He never cried in the video. He never cried in the video. But... And there was an ad... Seven minute video, two ad. minute ad, form of uh, five other minutes of nothing, and also we sub- we expected so much more of you. <laughs> yeah, man. Well, we had such high expectations. For I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> high expectations. Maybe mm. we had expectations. How about that? Mm-hmm. Uh, but I also like that he said, uh, you know, this is the longest he's ever taken away from YouTube. Right. And if he had taken like a weekend off, that would have also been the longest time. He had like, like he, wasn't he like vlogging every day or uh, something? Probably. Shit? Yeah. Oh wait, no, it was once a week. Oh, okay. So his yeah. new videos every Saturday and he crosses out, but Sunday, Sunday. nice. It's such a nice. Huge difference. So he's growing. Good. <laughs> <laughs> now you're uploading on the Lord's day. Yeah, exactly. Great. Even worse, man. Oh, it's coming out as a child of God. Mm-hmm. Now I get it. Well, that's a day of rest. You shouldn't be posting on Sunday. True. Yeah. Come on, man. You know what I wish? I wish there was a day of breast. Nice. Because boobs. Because tits. Nice. Titties. You know what I wish there was? A day of balls. <laughs> Sebastian balls. balls. <laughs> and now there is. There you go. And now there is. Every Sunday. The day of balls. The day of the Lord. <laughs> Lord balls. Lord balls. Lord balls. <laughs> Like like uh like Lord Voldemort. Yeah, you but, can't say uh, his name. You know, but with you know a ton of fucking foundation and stuff. And if someone edited the Harry Potter movies and replaced Voldemort with Sebastian Bale, yep. every shot or edit at, you at least edit the <laughs> with, with Sebastian. Yeah, that's really funny. Uh, Sab- Cabal! Sabrina, can you edit every Harry Potter movie? And yeah. put uh, Sebastian in as Voldemort? Yeah. Yeah, that shouldn't take too long. Uh, you know what? You don't even have to do... Do the first four. <laughs> you don't have to do all of them. Yeah, he only did, the he didn't four. fucking show up to the fourth it's one true. anyway. It's true. Yeah, do the last four then. Yeah. He showed up on the back of Professor Quirrell's head. Then he showed up... Uh, well, and then... Was he kind of in the second one? He was, in, he was like the book, was, right? Yeah, well, Tom Riddle showed up in the second one. <laughs> Tom Riddle. Tom Riddle. <laughs> Hey, cool, man. Like, <laughs> to pick a name like Voldemort, but then your f- real name is Tom, Tom Riddle. Tom Riddle. <laughs> cool, That dude. sounds like it should be, like, that should be the Riddler's name. Yeah, you're Tom right. Tom Riddle. Tom Riddle. Not Voldemort. Voldemort. Like. And then Prisoner of Ascap. Yeah, he wasn't in that one. No, it was just. Uh, Sirius well, Black. It wasn't yeah, a real. No, he wasn't no, no, the, he was, was, the he villain, was, He was. He was like little baby uh, him in, like, the, the Shrieking Shack or whatever. Was it the Shrieking Shack? Near the Whomping Willow? Was it baby version of it's just of alliterations, him? though. Yeah. What, what the, Shrieking Shack, Whomping Willow, Harry Hotter. Harry Hotter. <laughs> Harry Hotter. Harry <Yeah>. Hotter. <laughs> um, I think that was the fourth one. He was a little baby, and they poured, he, they threw that's, him into the cauldron. But that's but I'm talking about, because uh, Harry keeps having the dream about going to the Shrieking Shack, and Peter Pettigrew is there. Oh, and then he has a little... And then he has the thing It's of, the dream. It's the dream okay. where he walks in, and then they go, Oh, well, you know. Okay, so you could put, like, baby Sebastian Bales in the third one. Yep. And, and then, then the in the fourth, fourth one, one, you could... That whole scene. Do the scene. glow up of getting dropped in the cauldron and yeah. all that. And he comes out fully emerged. Yep. And then Order of the Phoenix. He's in that, too. Yeah, he is. Half-Blood Half Prince. Prince, he's in that. He's in that. <laughs> he's in Deathly Hallows <laughs> Part 1. one. 
And I else. think he's in part two. Yeah. I think he I, has he, a couple of scenes in part a, two. He has a cameo. In that one. Yeah. It's like a, it's a deleted almost. scene. Yeah. Um. Anyways, we just Z- so, summarize yeah. all the Harry Potter so movies. So I think the... Uh, Spoiler alert, Voldemort is in the last, the last four. He's in the last four. <laughs> he's in the last one. I know that. Yeah, at least. Yeah. Uh, I. So yeah, my theory is that Donald Trump and Voldemort are the, the two parents <laughs> of Sebastian Balls. <laughs> and we figured it out. We figured it out. We got... We, and that's the real truth. Yeah. Of all of this. <laughs> Two villains created this guy. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, we're at like fucking almost an hour. Jeez. That flew by. That did fly by. Flies, uh, fly, f- time flies time, when you're having balls. Time flies when you're having <laughs> balls. Um, all right. Well, that wraps it up, I think, for episode 181. Um, nice. Thanks for, ha- thanks for coming on, buddy. buddy. Anytime. Thanks for having Second me. Second person in the new studio love the new stew feels good um we got to get you and dean to come on for yeah. one episode so yeah. that'd be fun fuck um, around all three of us all three of us be super annoying mm-hmm. um but yeah guys go check out jacob's channel and go watch his youtube videos go check out his podcast his new podcast with jake doolittle yeah um and mr friendship is coming back and mr. coming back and david doesn't touch it and then, doesn't touch Jacob it. doesn't touch it um yeah just go check them out um, we got a video coming on. We your got channel a video soon. coming out on my channel on Friday. You know, so it'll just so much content. There's man. other stuff coming soon. Yeah, you know, huge, huge, huge stuff. Huge, huge exciting stuff announcements. Soon. Um, so stay tuned, man. Yeah. Stay tuned for more. We're keeping this gravy train going. Yeah, exactly. So subscribe every Sunday because we got balls videos coming for you. I just played a fart sound effect. Nice. Is Thanks. it the is it the the nuclear one like the? It's the yeah. yeah okay. the, I have it as the Demi Lovato fart because there's a video of Demi Lovato like filming herself and she films her butt, oh, and then they really put the funny. fart sound that's on. That's really it. funny because it is the fart that sounds like a butt puked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <It does. laughs> okay. Anyway, all, all right. right. Thanks. Thanks for listening, guys. <laughs> uh, check out the Patreon. I forgot yeah. to plug at the beginning. Fuck. See for ya. for some late night content, right? Yeah. All right. Well, thanks for having me on, buddy. Bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye, guys.